नमस्ते सत्या वेलकम टू आर लव लाफ लिव चैट शो प्यार हंसो ते जुग जुग जी वाला शो सो शो शो करने तो पहला ये कहना है जीना है तो ऐसे जिए जीना है तो ऐसे जिए हर सोच में प्यार शांत ते खुशबू आवे सो दिस मींस लेट्स लिव आर लाइफ विद ब्यूटीफुल थॉट्स फुल ऑफ लव पीस एंड फ्रेग्रेंस सो माय नेम इज दविंदर रूबी आई एम अ लाइफ एंड स्पिरिचुअल कोच एंड माय लवली कोहस्ट एम एंड माय नेम इज गुरदियाल गाचा एंड आई एम एन एंपावरमेंट एंड रेजिलिएंस कोच So Dad, what's today's topic going to be about? So today's topic is going to be on the seven chakras, the consciousness centers and what is their purpose and how do they affect our well-being. So sad is see the kita asar panda with these seven chakras. So we're going to enjoy doing this because we learned so much as mm-hmm. we were, you know, doing the preparation of this. Okay, so I'm just going to talk very briefly about um the beginning of the chakra. So the chakra is Sanskrit for um wheel, which is a spinning colored light. Um so it's first recorded writing about chakras originates in India around uh, 1500 BC. Um so we've heard that everything that exists um is permeated and kept alive and evolved by cosmic energy. Um that we can that we're all <clears throat> we we all we're all the power the spirit of god i mean we use different different words some people might say parmatma love energy um and it's all around us and it's within us and and this is what keeps us healthy strong and alive so so just be conscious of that when we're talking about the chakras mm. so we're going to discuss how does it keep us alive and uh, so i want to show you this little what with this little diagram we did if you can hold that for me good yeah, no so i had jare hai gena um these colored circles eh chakras hai gena so satne from the root to the sacral to the solar plexus the heart chakra the throat chakra the, you know the you know the mind chakra and the crown chakra so like we're trying to say jare good day kari se ki everything around us is energy and did energy the name we can call it uh pramatma or mighty god you know we can have so many names for it and a higher consciousness and did the energy and this is uh, exists everywhere and this will actually keeps us alive and and it actually affects our sadhi sharir our body there so did upara jada kala ja hai kana this will be called is the nucleus of the soul and it's like we call it another name like the spark of god mm. or god spark and it's situated like you said on top of the crown chakra and so the universal energy did he hai gana did up the energy ya it always flows down the left side first into our body right down to a sort of like the pelvic and we call it the collective basin did at the bottom bit there mm. and then as it flows down the sort of like the left side and then it goes up the right side and all the way back through the nucleus and goes back into up in the higher junctions but on its way this spirit energy that we're calling it high consciousness of the energy it runs along the seven junctions of these energy centers what should we call um you know consciousness centers or the chakras and the purpose of this is the matlab ki the why it does this because it rub the energy ana it flows through all of these so it can give what we would call the meridian these paths so through the nerves and it goes to ek ek organ there which you know it did it up the energy it supplies this life force energy to keep the cells healthy and strong so it did ek ek chakra ana it is filled with different light pulsating light and rotating su- structure which go go jan there and then then the supply this this energy god's energy and t- through the nervous system so in a healthy body in a jada healthy sharir hove this energy we call it prana chi it flows through all the parts of the organism without any obstruction that mean koi recovered ni hagi when it's a healthy body but it, if it is only when an organ that like let's say that a heart that organ hoy kidneys hoy liver hoy you know <coughs> when it's no longer supplied to the energy nahi milti ha na and that's when bamari shuru hundi hai so the root cause of bamari is when it rub the energy is not flowing and there's an obstruction and so this is what we call um unbalanced chakra this is where the blockage happens and jodo eh ho jinde na blockage this is when up in shri the cells and become ill and sluggish so how can these blockages happen good there 
So, so the reason that these blockages happen is when we, we become more self-absorbed. You know, we're sensing, we're thinking. It's all to do with our own self. and we, It's kind of coming from a selfish place. And it's the opposite of love. The negative thoughts. So it's, it's being conscious that this is what's happening. So the outside energy field can recognize when we're saying negative things yeah, yeah. about ourselves. So this is what starts to affect the inside of our body. And, you know, we're specifically talking about um, the root chakra today. Mm -hmm. um, so every chakra, it can have a blockage, but it also depends on certain things which are happening within our life mm -hmm. and the way we're thinking about ourselves. Um, so there's a direct um, impact of um, you know, your emotions, your behavior, your thoughts. So all of this will affect that, the particular chakra that um, is affected by the mood or That's your right. emotions yeah. and all There's those kinds of things. There's a theme there that affects so, a different chakra. <clears throat> So medicine might help, um, but it won't, it won't get rid of the problem completely. So, so this is where, you know, our bodies are tu tuned into, an, into this energy and, um, and we need to just be aware of the kind of stuff that we're saying to ourselves. Yeah, yeah. So it's all about, that is it's thought, yeah, it would affect that chakra or the unbalance or the fibromari shuru or anything. Yeah. So we decided that for the next seven episodes, we'll talk about each chakra in depth. Kidan de socha, kidan de sade emotions, yeah, that causes a blockage, and ote kere sade shri de organs no asar penda, bura asar penda. So we decided that aaj the episode we're gonna discuss the root chakra. And chala root chakra hai kana, this is the one right at the bottom. So eda theme kia, eda kidan de socha that causes a blockage, and and actually we're gonna discuss what causes a blockage, and we're gonna discuss at the end how we can heal these blockages. So the root chakra is the first chakra and it's located at the, like you said, a picture of the colors, it's spine, at the base of the spine. The, we call it the collective basin in the region of the coccyx. Do you think the bone right at the bottom when we sit on it? Yeah, it's that bone in your bone, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, that this is yeah. where the root chakra energy center is. And it's, um, and it's the deepest connection with our physical body and the environment and with Earth, which we call Mother Earth, Artima. And it's a survival center and it's all about fight or flight or freeze response um, initiated from this chakra. Mm -hmm. So it's where it's our primal and uh, animal, our animal nature. nature hundi, hundi. Yeah. So the root chakra allows us to harness ourselves, our resourcefulness and our will to live during trying times. So, so it's it's there, it's connected to Earth and Mother Earth, but it's gonna have its, its theme is about us to feel safe in this world, feel connected to Mother Earth and experiences the human experience we're gonna have on this earth, even mm. though we're spiritual beings. Yeah. So it's our existence on this planet. So let's say to a card to see building hoe to have a really a secure, long-lasting house, but the foundation has to be solid. solid. Yeah. Mm. So this is where the root chakra. We got to be really grounded and rooted and feeling safe. And and when we have thoughts that we don't feel safe, this is what causes the blockage. Um, so the root chakra <coughs> has to have a function a function to the optimum to really to be healthy. So what you're saying is the root chakra that's got to be the most solid that's in order right. for the rest of them to kind of be yeah. balanced along there. Yeah. That's your your base of your it, we'd say that in a building, but in human beings, yeah. we would say that is the, the most solid part in in order for the rest to work properly. Exactly. Yeah. So it's all about we root chakra is about <coughs> feeling safe in our basic needs. Mm. So like if they're not met, such like basic needs like food or water, shelter, in a security, we cannot grow spiritually because we need to have that in order to grow spiritually. Because because we're then otherwise we're in survival mode, aren't we? Yeah, exactly. Because until we've got those things food shelter um, you know like a warm place to stay then mm. we can't grow spiritually because yeah our basic needs aren't being met so it's like here so if we don't feel safe in there mm. and we're worried and we uh, we cannot move up these chakras because more we move up these chakras we're connecting more to more the higher conscious yeah. to God 
So, but we need to feel safe here. Yeah, because that's the foundation of that's who we right. are. Yeah, exactly. <coughs> so. so, you know, and, and so this is another way of saying that if you don't feel safe in a re relationship, you are going to struggle mm. um, because you can't grow if you feel unsafe. And this all goes back to the root chakra, your, your actual solidness within anything, because that is who you are. So you're not going to feel safe. Um, if you're not safe in your foundation, then you're not going to have great connections, great relationships with people. So many times we lose our connection with the planet. And when we talk about losing connection, we're talking about, um, you know, because of technology, because of living indoors, you know, we're sort of staying in a digital world now where you know we'd rather be on our phones or watching TV or Netflix or all these other things which are take our attention away mm -hmm. from from the mother earth the, the connection with the planet and things like that and that's what can eventually start to affect us because in, in ancient times you know we treated ourselves we didn't you know rely on medicine everything yeah. was herbal yeah. and, and there were no side effects so you know life's changing so much now um, you know we really need to be conscious of it we don't go out as much as we could we don't spend time in you know the tree not the trees I mean we're not monkeys but <laughs> but uh, you know in the forest um, you know being with mother earth sitting down on the grass walking on the grass um, because we'd rather be in the house attached to some kind of device and and this is where we're, we're losing connection and and that's where we tend to have uh, like children and you say they nowadays they talk more about feeling stressed and their mental health yeah. issues because yeah. they're too much in the technology which is world it's a techno yeah, that's technological right. world isn't it but children when we in long long time ago I suppose mm -hmm. but when they're more outdoors playing out in the natural nature Hana, they were more in tune with with the like the energy of the earth where, where the energy of the earth was all about feeling safe secure and connected and being healthy all the times so because the, let's say the grounded energy it helped to remove natural toxins from mm -hmm. our body even thoughts were toxins yeah, yeah. negative thoughts but when children nowadays spend more time indoors now you have a lot of people complain about children young age are having uh, stress related illnesses at a yeah. very young age and it's all because we spend more time indoors and not outdoors yeah and then we got we've got children who who are so um, addicted to their phones and things like that but th that's not just children it's adults as well yeah, yeah. and we're becoming more and more disconnected from each other yeah. when really we are so connected to each other and the earth and the planet yeah. and th and that's where we, our su survival comes from but anyway you're going to talk a little bit more about the root chakra and how yeah. So the root chakra connects us to our, even our spiritual energies of our ancestors. You know, their challenges and their yeah. triumphs are, snor are stored in our DNA, passed on to us. So we are an evolution of, this is really amazing, evolution mm -hmm. of 13.8 billion years. Yeah. So also the underly cell, the which DNA Hundana, is full, it stores all the memories and experiences that's brought to us from the point and it's demonstrating it's right now. So mm -hmm. Jokut Sari, kinde generation, generation, kinde janam family chayam. Janam, janam, janam. Ona the memory study yeah. DNA which store yeah. Honda. So that's why sometimes stuff keeps coming up because there is no, there is so much in us that we're not even aware of. Sometimes all of a sudden we might feel you know, tension, or anxiety, or worry, or mm. fear, and these fears can be our ancestral yeah. memories that come up. Mm. So, because since this chakra, the root chakra, carries all our ancestral memories of everyone's experience and challenges, this causes blockages within mm. our root chakra, such so as the wars, famine, natural disasters, and any event that threaten our basic survival are all recorded within the energies of the first mm. chakra. Mm. So that is why some countries or some religions have this pattern <coughs> where <coughs> war is part of their culture, mm. you know, and that is not that has been passed down from generations to generations, creating unconscious behavioral patterns stored in their DNA where they just think that war is the only solution to peace. Yeah, but it's yeah. something they're just automatically doing because it's stored in their DNA. And this is also, are you going to talk more about the inner child? But yeah, yeah. Um, so just going back a little bit to what you're saying about the wars. They haven't evolved. No. That's what we're saying. But you know, they might do yoga, they might look at so they've evolved more. But 
ਕੋਈ ਕੋਈ ਕੰਟਰੀਆਂ ਲੋਕ ਹੈਗੇ ਜਿਹੜੇ ਦੇ ਸਟਿਲ ਫਾਈਟ ਕਰਕੇ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਹੁੰਦਾ ਵੀ ਬਸ ਪ੍ਰੋਬਲਮ ਆ ਇਹ ਹੀ ਅਸੀਂ ਸੋਰਟ ਆਊਟ ਕਰ ਸਕਦੇ ਹਾਂ ਸੋ ਦੇ ਸਟਿਲ ਇਨ ਸਰਵਾਈਵਲ ਮੋਡ ਆਨ ਲਾਈਕ ਰੀਅਲੀ ਇਟਸ ਬਿਕਾਜ਼ ਇਟਸ ਲੋਕ ਨੋਟ ਸਮਾਟਿਕ ਬਿਕਾਜ਼ ਇਨ ਦੇ ਡੀ ਐਨ ਏ ਐਂਡ ਥੈਟਸ ਵਾਈ ਦਾ ਰੂਟ ਚੈਕਰਾ ਵੀ ਅਫੈਕਟਡ ਐਨੀਥਿੰਗ ਟੂ ਡੂ ਵਿਦ ਔਨ ਥੈਟ ਬੇਸਿਸ ਆਫ ਹਾਊ ਦੇ ਟ੍ਰਾਈ ਟੂ ਸਰਵਾਈਵ ਐਸ ਅ ਹਿਊਮਨ ਸਪੀਸੀਜ਼ ਔਨ ਥਿਸ ਪਲੈਨਟ ਯਾ ਆ ਮੀਨ ਜਿੱਥੇ ਅਸੀਂ ਸੋਚਦੇ ਹਾਂ ਵੀ ਜਿਹੜੇ ਨਿਆਣਿਆਂ ਦੇ ਜੋ ਦੇ ਨਿਆਣੇ ਛੋਟੇ ਹੁੰਦੇ ਵੀ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਕੋਈ ਵੀ ਕੋਈ ਪ੍ਰੋਬਲਮ ਹੁੰਦੀ ਹੈ ਇਟਸ ਦੈ ਇਨਰ ਚਾਈਲਡ ਇਟਸ ਦੈ ਟ੍ਰੋਮਾਸ ਦੈ ਦੇਵ ਬੀਨ ਥਰੂ ਫਰਮ ਫਰਮ ਅ ਵੈਰੀ ਲੌਂਗ ਟਾਈਮ ਐਂਡ ਆ ਹੈਵ ਟ੍ਰਬਲ ਸੇਇੰਗ ਥੈਟ ਵਰਡ ਇਟਸ ਦ ਸੋਅਸ ਦ ਸੋਅਸ ਮਸਲ ਯਾ ਵਿਚ ਇਜ਼ ਦ ਰੂਟ ਚੈਕਰਾ ਵਿਚ ਵੀ ਟਾਲਕਿੰਗ ਅਬਾਊਟ ਇਨ ਦ ਏਰੀਆ ਆਫ ਦ ਰੂਟ ਚੈਕਰਾ ਬਟ ਥੈਟਸ ਵੇਰ ਵੀ ਹੋਲਡ ਆਲ ਆਰ ਚਾਈਲਡਹੂਡ ਟ੍ਰੋਮਾਸ ਬਟ ਜੋ ਸਾਰੀ ਮੈਮਰੀ ਸਟੋਰ ਹੁੰਦੀ ਹੈ ਤਾਂ ਉਹ ਤੋਂ ਫਿਰ ਅਸੀਂ ਸੋਚ ਸਕਦੇ ਵੀ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਬਾਹਰਲੀ ਦੁਨੀਆ ਉਹ ਸੇਫ ਨਹੀਂ ਹੈਗੀ ਸਾਡੇ ਲਈ ਸੋ ਅਸੀਂ ਫਿਰ ਉਹ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਡਰਾਵਾ ਹੁੰਦਾ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਡਰ ਹੁੰਦਾ ਹੈ ਟੂ ਐਕਚੁਅਲੀ ਬੀ ਆਊਟਸਾਈਡ ਔਰ ਬੀ ਕਨੈਕਟਿਡ from an outward view mm-hmm. but really what we really want is to feel loved and nurtured biji da sanu jida apa punjabi ch kende ya saadi dharti maa ya you know mm-hmm. everything that we need and want mm-hmm. is within the earth yes. yeah. and we don't need to sort of think of it from internally yeah. from in our heads yeah. because everything is outside but it's about trusting it and not having the fear yeah. and um you know everything is energy and that's where all of our fulfilling you know comes from yeah. and but at the moment um from the root chakra it's all about material materialistic things yeah. that we require or we want or we feel that yeah. we need I mean if think about it the butcher uh, comes into this world what is needs it needs his mother's love mm. wants a mother to keep him Care. warm sheltered feed yeah. and uh, and this is a mother's natural instinct nature mm-hmm. and, and so dharti ma the mother earth what we rooted to that also provides the same needs yeah, yeah. you know the, the 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 earth provides us with the food, food and resources you know so when we connect <coughs> with mother earth more it keeps us healthy and strong mm. but when we spend less time we connected to the mother earth that's where we start fear comes in yeah. because if you imagine a child the man ah hai ki is is not there is moment for a while is the mother's gone to work or is, or she's busy all day the child chota chota bachcha will start to feel fear yeah. the mere yeah. mummy kithe gayi yeah. hai na so the more we say connected to this earth the more we feel safe mm. and uh, so we're going to talk about um, so these are the key key characteristics of the root chakra um so this is when you're in balance you know your mind your body is in balance so the first chakra is associated with the following behavior characteristics so the security safety empowerment to root chakra is to feel content satisfied to succeed and progress in life it's also about overcoming survival you know your basic needs food sleep shelter um self preservation uh, physical identity it keeps us grounded and out of our minds mm-hmm. so to and it also means that we're unable to feel settled in life support supported and the foundation for living our lives so that's where you know the characteristics are of the root chakra when it's balanced yeah. when it's healthy and uh, so but do the when the root chakra is not balanced and it's blocked so no, if you're wondering if you will think about this and recognize any of these sort of um it's characteristics. Like characteristics so let's say uh if you're excessive negativity uh, cynical and pessimistic uh fear based thoughts uh e- eating disorders mm. is one and feeling unsettled greed um we have also anger excessive feeling of insecurity living in survival mode all the time feeling threatened feeling under attack uh stress related illnesses worry depression anxiety panic attacks so if if you can recognize any of these characteristics then you know that the root chakra na is unbalanced and that the blockage has gear mm-hmm. so it's good so to be healing, aware of that yeah 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 definitely so the healing tips be as if the as the as the jida jidiyan da apne hon mentioned kitiyan where your root balance root chakra is imbalance mm-hmm. so this is how you can heal ask aa chi ja kan de naal na tonu raam aa sakda hai jithe toda man man bhi shant ho sakda toda sharir bhi shant ho sakda hai so connection to the earth so take care of immediate needs to prevent worry and secure insecurity so je tonu koi fikr hai ga ya kaise cheez bare fir tusi socho bhi main je ta main fikr kardi ha ja whatever main pata kara so that that worry doesn't become bigger and bigger to fir tode man te asar pe tode security fi build hundi hai um ta jadon bhi tusi koi salah karni hai trust it and darona ki jehdi bhi thodi um salah sahi hai 
that's okay you know je kuch galat bhi ho gaya it's still going to be okay koi jyada nuksan nahi hon laga um you know um physical activity je je tusi baithe rehnde ha apne phone te ya tv te fir mallo malli thodi sharir te um negative cheeza honiya hai man te vi tasreer te vi so so go to the gym ya tusi park nu jao jithe tusi connection hai gi thodi um dharti maa de naal so that's what we's kind of saying um ta je tusi chahunde ha bhi bas main andar hi rama news sunna bar bahut dal nala sama hai ga don't trust that trust your own instincts bar ja wo um you know lokan nu milo jo lo things like that ta tusi apni bhi jyada care karo ke tusi um sochde ha ke main apne aap nu pyar karde ha ta main love karde meri mere ch confidence hai ge main self respect hai ga ya so aa sariya cheeza karan de naal tusi mallo malli you know thodi soch um badhiya rehndi hai thode layi vi te thode sareer layi ta last cheez hai gi hai ke um ਮਾਫ ਕਰੋ ਆਪਣੇ ਆਪ ਨੂੰ ਵੀ ਮਾਫ ਕਰੋ ਪਰ ਲੋਕਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਵੀ ਮਾਫ ਕਰੋ ਸੋ ਕਰਕੇ ਇਹ ਇਹ ਸਭ ਤੋਂ ਜ਼ਰੂਰੀ ਚੀਜ਼ ਹੈ ਜਿੱਥੇ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਆਰਾਮ ਆ ਸਕਦਾ ਆ ਸੋ ਦੀਸ ਇਜ਼ ਅ ਹੀਲਿੰਗ ਟੈਕਸ ਐਂਡ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਗੋਇੰਗ ਟੂ ਮੈਂਸ਼ਨ ਆਮ ਦ ਕਲੀਅਰਿੰਗ ਐਂਡ ਦ ਬੈਲੈਂਸਿੰਗ ਆਫ ਦ ਰੂਟ ਚੈਕ ਸੋ ਵੀ ਵਾਂਟ ਟੂ ਕਲੀਅਰ ਐਂਡ ਬੈਲੈਂਸ ਇਫ ਦੇ ਬਲੋਕੇਜ ਹੈ ਕੀ ਆ ਵੀ ਕੈਨ ਡੂ ਥਿਸ ਟ੍ਰਾਈ ਥਿਸ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਥਿੰਗਸ ਥੈਟ ਵੀ ਕੈਨ ਐਕਚੁਅਲੀ ਹੈਲਪ ਟੂ ਪੁੱਟ ਦ ਰੂਟ ਚੈਕ ਬੈਕ ਇਨ ਟੂ ਨੋਰਮਲ ਫੰਕਸ਼ਨ ਐਂਡ ਬੈਲੈਂਸ ਐਂਡ ਸੋ ਯੂ ਕੈਨ ਟ੍ਰਾਈ ਲਾਈਕ ਟੂ ਦਾ ਧਿਆਨ ਹਨ ਪੁੱਟ ਯੂਰ ਅਟੈਂਸ਼ਨ ਧਿਆਨ to the base so you know, I would usually shut my eyes when I do yeah. this a kabant karke so imagine I got my focus there and I can see the red chakra there and then I that's what I normally do and then I surround it all the while I put red because red is associated to the root chakra so I visualize the the chakra all in red and then I just see the light spinning counterclockwise for females and and then clockwise for men is mm-hmm. interesting that is and then you can either try this repeat a mantra and it goes sort of like a uh, lam om em harim shreem sri mantra namo lam namo lam and you can do that because jere the reason we say these mantras because everything's energy like yeah. we said and every it's everything energy then everything has its frequency and <coughs> every frequency has um power to it in the sense that it can be low frequency using low vibration words or there can be high frequency words did that these have high frequency you know um mm-hmm. f- sensation in our body and healing so th- by repeating this they will, these particular ones will be associated to the same frequency of the root chakra so the balancing hoj in there but if you don't want to do that even that's fine because you can use the affirmations like so i am safe and secure yeah. i love life and life loves me all my needs are met i am enjoying my existence um on the beautiful safe world i am safe and grounded to mother or earth or at all times so ji main hone he punjabi ch kama um ke tusi keh sakde ve main theek ha main bahut life nu love karde ha life mainu vi bahut pyar karde ha pe jehdi vi cheezan mainu chahiye ho mainu meldiyan ha ta main jidda vi main rehndi ha is duniya de vich mein vi sara kuch theek ha mile vi baar li duniya vi bahut pyar karde ha ta andar li vi meri soch vi bahut badhiya ha and i'm safe and grounded bhi mere so, meri soch bala jidda um drave wale nahi hai ke bhi mere soch bhi jehde hai ke they calm and peaceful and mm-hmm. pyar pyar na bhare pae ya so these words ha na are very high frequency words yeah. so and it, and then the um, wordings will directly would affect the root chakra so this will heal the root <coughs> chakra and also like you said it's a red color chakra yeah. so red I always visualize root chakra red and um and then another thing you can do eat a lot of root vegetables mm. you know because it's all root based because they're very high frequency uh, so they will also heal the root chakra and keep it healthy and uh, oh, there's so many of these things you can do mm. but um you know you got an unbalanced root chakra did that see you know if, you if you're you thinking all of those negative things thoughts like and fear and anger all those yeah. you know so you then you know so <coughs> <coughs> the what we're going to discuss next is the next as a discussion thode na karange jeda because we're saying that each chakra jeda hai kya na they associated to particular organs in the body in bodies, yeah. you know jeda uh, so the root chakra has its own organs and jeda unbalanced ho janda na we have me these negative thoughts because jeda sare thoughts ya na sare sare soch ya na 
it could be negative sort or positive sort. Um, if it's a positive sort, and those are the organs that affect how they are thick and they say healthy and they But when it's a negative sort, for all he did organs and all the body shuru ho in there. So I'm going to give you uh, some of the parts of the body that's associated to the root chakra. So I'm going to discuss knees. So the good day. So these are associated with the the sort side like where we feel soft devaluation, feeling unworthy like um, I don't feel good about myself yeah so and it could be something like yeah we feel I'm not good enough I'm comparing myself everybody started men are better there I'm worthless I'm use, useless I'm mm. useless I've done this sort you know I'm my important near Baki are important yeah mm. I'm poor I'm equality uh, everybody's better than me sorry yeah. Mila but yeah my coach be near my second rate yeah make a uh, I'm unskilled I'm out shot near again these sort of um, thoughts causes the imbalance in the root chakra but also affects the knees yeah yeah so we see for um so a jiria socha and then all jaan belief karna jaan emotions and a good day the answer for kardaya so either matter of a cabridge the jc sports karna ya that's a see for stiffness we feel cars like they are jazzy so it's like they be method to carry you on a i can't run i can't walk we made it made a good day in charlie so i see ये अपने बारे कह लगे तो कई बार इदा हों कि स्टिफ हो जाते हैं तुम स्टबन भी हो सकते भी मतलब जिदी जिदा सो थोड़े मन पर भी तुम थोड़ी परसनैलिटी भी असर करता है कि जो वैन यू रूच हैक्टर आउट बैलेंस एंड सोचते हैं भी जिते भी थोड़ी लाइफ है भी उत्थे ठीक है तुम चाहते भी मैं थोड़े कि गहन होव मैं अपने आप को बधाव यू नो लाइक टू मेक योर लाइफ बैटर सो यू खा kind of stuck so so this is all about your thoughts and your beliefs and and how it affects your knees i mean uh, to see um have a think that uh, people have issues with bad knees ha na jinna de good any problem hai ki hai or not to see character you know if you think about somebody yeah, who's got I know, knee problems yeah i know i know somebody with a lot of knee problems and they do have this on the other thing the kafi ziddi ne and they like to stand their ground you know i'm not going to give way so you do f- notice that there is yeah. correlation huh mm-hmm. that people that they have these sort of sort and beliefs and but then you said this is when people who are very ziddi why they ziddi because they feel like um, You know, they're not good enough I they're think. not good enough yeah. and they think that you know if <clears throat> or the control because they feel if you don't control the situation they feel like um they're going to fall apart they, the only way they can survive is a, a survival thing remember this root chakra so i need to be in controlling to control others that's the only way i'm able to survive and people need to listen to what i need to say because i need to feel important in that sense but also um if you think about the knees if you're not using your knees and you're sitting and not valuing yourself but then probably judging other people mm. and you know, there's a comparison there then you're not using your knees you're not going out walking about you're not in nature yeah. so it's everything that's happening is affecting you mm. subsequently because of you know not not valuing yourself yeah. and then not value not valuing other people either mm. so it's it's sort of something that's um, happening within your body but it's also something that's happening externally i like the word that so, you say about crisis in confidence because if you don't feel safe just in doubt like that every time you know uh, and then those sort of people usually have no confidence self esteem mm. so Uh, in order to feel really safe on this planet on this earth you really need to connect like you're saying to mother uh, earth to mother earth because the more you connect to mother earth the more to the confidence fund there so you just naturally get these uh, innate gifts and way of thinking yeah. and behaving you know yeah i mean if you think about it if you if somebody goes out for a walk into the woods in a beautiful space mm. the weather's good the trees are there it's calm it's calm it's peaceful naturally you're going to be absorbing you know those positive effects on your body That's which true. would then have a positive effect on your mind yeah. so so it's a win-win situation 
Yeah, like we were discussing the other day, <coughs> because there are many more, many more in time in nature. To say, oh, they thought they characteristic yeah. qualities behind in there, because mm. nature has that characteristics yeah. of just being uh, peaceful, with, peaceful, with the flow, it has no sort of feeling of uh, comparison, or judging, competition. And, uh, competition, because that's how nature just lives together yeah. in harmony. And, and we are so connected yeah. to the earth. I mean, we spoke about this the other day, where. <laughs> You know, we are nature. Mm. We we are doing the exact same thing. Mm. We're also growing, and yeah. you know, just like you know, we mentioned autumn and the leaves coming yeah. down. You know, that's what happens to us as human beings. Mm. But anyway, going back to the next. Um, so the other organ, the pelvis. The pelvis. So pelvis, I think, what we call it, which is sort yeah, of area. Yeah, it's sort of around that area that yeah. protects the the womb and that. Yeah. So so this gets under a health issue when we have thoughts like, um, let's say, a woman who feels that she doesn't feel good enough as a woman. Mm. Well, after now, I'm not, she's always judgmental, critical, after nooks and then she doesn't feel pretty, or she feels that like she's not good enough for a mm. partner, you know, a ma you know, no matter what I do, my partner won't like me. So, and then the negative thoughts will affect her you know, around her, that area there, where she will feel even that, you know, no matter how I try, how pretty I look, I won't attract the right partner in my life. So that would affect that Bachadani area, yeah. they have a health yeah. issues in there. And um, the hip one's good, that'd be good. Yeah, so, so we say for hip, we say in Punjabi, we say luck. And this is a similar self, it's a similar thing, um, a devaluation theme, you know, be jiri saadi socha, saadi emotions on there, jo kush pe asi kaar deya, ki it affects the hip area. So, you know, <coughs> so we're unable to endure or handle something. Be jodho bhi koi problem on the, it could be with our partner, with our children, or relationship sanu, asi andro andri, we don't address the issue, so we feel fearful that oh, you know, jame ucha bolya ja bolli to my boss or something. Be but then ki hojina. So we just absorb that within ourselves. We keep tolerating. And, yeah, it. we tolerate it tolerate until it. you become older and older, and before you know it, this will then affect mainly women, the luck area or the hip area, where you notice, you know, as people get older, they they walk a certain way because you know hip replacements are something that is very very common, and it, it weakens that bone structure around there. Mm. Um, so this is how, you know, it affects your confidence and over time, mm. rather than just your confidence, it then affects that area in your body. So I like that lovely example, did that an elderly woman can feel an aged woman who most of her life also had did a, mm. all his probably abusive behavior, what, or it could be any of his negative yeah. character. It could be anybody, it could be a yeah. boss as well. He's quite dominating <coughs> in character in her life, but most Excuse of women me tend to keep thinking it's my husband, yeah. you know, Sahari Jana, you know, tolerate it, tolerate, tolerate it. But it comes to a stage, especially when they get much older. When they get much older, yeah. they're tired and they're exhausted, because taking care of the family, the children, everyone. And that's when they think, I can't withstand this situation, I can't tolerate it anymore. And you, it's interesting, you know, because older women tend to have the hip fractures and yeah. the hip, you know, issues. So that's why they say that this is this negative thought that we you know, toleration and can't withstand it. This causes unbalance in the root chakra, which then affects the hip yeah. organ, so around yeah. there. So this is why you can see that it's so interesting when you get into mm. this, that uh, each chakra, when it's fully functioning properly, it can keep the either organ healthy, or it can actually cause the problem with health issues will start stemming from there. Mm -hmm. So I really, I do like that one because mm -hmm. I know quite a people, few people with hip problems and I've actually seen it, how their relationships with... How they behave and how they behave and what they've been tolerating. Yeah. Yeah. And it's interesting, there's a lot in um, in unknown Asian older women, mm. so it's interesting to see the, the, the pattern there. So the next one, which is the lumbar spine, it you get into the, the lower back, and that's again, it's about a self-devaluation where you feel like I don't like myself, I'm not good enough, you know, but it's to do with uh, self-worth, you know, and, and my whole personality, and it's about 
the main theme there is about either I don't feel minu ko support nahi mildi mo ma kisi nu support nahi kar sakta because you think the backbone is like it's 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 that whole, the backbone is what holds the whole of your body yeah, up yeah. and and this is where you know if that's not strong and everything like that this is going to affect your relationships with people your career your personality mm. everything else like that so if you if that part's not strong and that's where you are going to i mean because there is a similar theme where you mm. do devalue yourself yeah um and you start kind of saying negative things that like, you know my life's work is destroyed i'm no good yeah. and 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 there's a theme of not feeling good in in everything that we've mentioned it's like some people have this you know say that you know you're my backbone yeah. you have my back yeah you have my back so this that is very common isn't it yeah you have my back so people really de- depend on this backbone mm. the lumbar spine for support it's all about support and it keeps us upright it keeps us moving keeping yeah. us strong you know and to enable to survive on this planet we got to in order to survive we need that backbone but when did that and then it sort out on the like like you said i'm not good when will i have a good perfect relationship mere paise chal gaye money chal gaye i'm crushed you know yeah, my job's no good my um, career is not going anywhere and how often people say minu koi changi tarah mein support nahi karta or people men probably think that oh i've lost my job my family and get that support karunga so they under so much pressure and and then they just and they sometimes think i turn my back on someone mm. they have that or some some people say get off my back yeah. so these sort of things are all against the opposite of love which is love is a god energy and then if you're going against love of who we are this is what causes a blockage in the root mm. chakra and this this it then the thoughts actually affect the lumbar spine yeah yeah and the next one that we were going to mention was um the ankles and this is again get get, you know <laughs> yeah so they can be very very pretty but sometimes they can be swollen and yeah. you know it depends how you look at it um so again we're going back to the thoughts the beliefs the emotions that affect the ankles mm-hmm. and again it, it is about self devaluation not being able to walk dance balance and sometimes people stop themselves from going and actually appreciating you know the job of the ankles you know i've sprained my so i can't go to the board i'm not agile enough i can't dance or oh, why did i trip so all these things kind of stop you in your tracks but it also stops a lot of your enjoyment mm-hmm. so so when you're saying these negative things to yourself in terms of just that part of your body mm-hmm. your gut there which sounds awful by the way <laughs> um you know um I've worked my socks off so you kind of putting a lot of negative energy into that specific area of your body mm. and and again it can cause imbalance in the root chakra and then the last one or was no we've the got foot. foot yeah we've foot is yeah. very uh, because again it's all about self evaluation we don't feel worthy about yourself and it's uh, and it's uh, I think the theme around there the conflict is mobility yeah about yeah. movement you know mm-hmm. can i move ahead in life you know am i have i got good skills with my feet you know especially like sports people you know flexibility yeah. inability to stand or walk you know uh, like i said um a person somebody with, uh, like a football and have a negative thought i think kick the football properly you know and so it will start to go really to self judgment and yeah. it starts self devaluing itself thinking <coughs> you know i'm a useless player i can't do this properly um i can't and sometimes a situation where to see go uh you have an issue or problem and you can't seem to get away from mm-hmm. it let's say problem away at home and because and you sometimes you're stuck in an environment you can't get away from and i just can't move on from this yeah, and yeah. and so that would cause issues and then the thoughts will cause problems you can't, with the feet. you can't you're on a loop aren't you yeah. you're kind of judging yourself and you you're kind of staying in that um, negative thought process and and that's how it can affect what about you? i'm dragging my feet yeah. i mean that's a good one where you feel like it's this procrastination. that's procrastination yeah. so that sort of thinking well I, i'm dragging my feet because i felt fearful fearful whether i able to achieve this mm. will i make a fool out of myself yeah. so you start dragging your feet and actually allowing yourself to fully feel safe secure to actually actually find yourself to actually go in there and just take do it give it your full faith and trust that i can accomplish this Yeah and that's where you know you've got to have the confidence you've got to come out of your comfort zone mm. so so the feet is a really really interesting one because yeah. when we think about um, moving forward in life mm. and and actually being stuck so that's 
where your feet come in because you consciously you've got to look at whether you're you're ready to even move forward because a lot of people are happy being where they know what's happening and doing something different coming out of your comfort zone requires a lot of confidence yeah. you know positive feelings positive um self-worth and and things like that and yeah. thinking so, about your feet it, it can definitely stop you from moving on with your life so think this is sort of if you've got problems with your feet pain <coughs> and then think is this where any areas in my life that i think these sort of negative thoughts Hannah? so actually we, we gave a bit of examples of different organs and i did it uh, the, it affects if you've got an unbalanced and block root chakra. So the only way we can help you with this now to understand how to change your thoughts. So we're going to give you some uh, examples of how to identify this. What kind of thoughts my key thoughts there, key thoughts there that actually then how can I change this thinking to bring my root chakra back into balance. And when the root chakra is back into balance, that would heal my health issues. So, so if we just go back to when the root chakra is out of balance so that's when the negative thoughts come in and so if you can just go over that which is when you're angry you're you're judging yourself you're you're not being kind to yourself and you're saying things which are you know devaluing who you are yeah. so those that's when we that's when your root chakra is out of balance yeah so so just imagine so you've got to identify to see socho ke kodo me apne aap nu judge kar de ha kodo me apne aap nu criticize kar de ha so to see ki kehne ha apne aap nu when when that's happening i mean if you think about it what words would you say uh, where is all this coming from it would be fear wouldn't it yeah it all comes down to fear yeah. because fear is the main sort of like emotion that's attached to the root chakra yeah. fear because on the planet earth we are living in this fight or flight can this you know in survival mode so it's always about if i the fear is all about death yeah so if i don't able to um feel good about myself or support someone so the main core fear is on death what's going to happen to me yeah. what could happen to my family what could happen to my friends yes. or my home that's so right. all of those things that you value that's what you're fearful of yeah because if as soon as you're not scared of death or then what is there to be scared of yeah, there's nothing to be scared of anymore yeah, but the death comes from if i because the mother earth mother nature provides us with the shelter food resources if i don't have the resources to feed myself feed my family you know have a shelter have money all these sort of thing materialistic things then the fear of death you know that's what it's all around so mm -hmm. so we can even fear of death when we like we said judge or criticize ourselves thinking I'm not good enough I'm useless in fam useless and I can't able to support my family or whatever so, so the change you can bring to that is like is, um, is things like saying nice things to yourself jithe tusi keh sakde ha jidda marzi hage you know having the faith bi parmatma ne jo kuch bhi karna hai sahi karna hai mere bhale liye karna hai so it's just changing your thoughts and not um jo jede bhi tusi sochde ha tusi pyar na so which they are to see dar dar you're not coming from a place of fear Yes. So, so that's so what the main thing is. So if you're criticizing yourself, <coughs> you are not a judge. Criticize, carry it on there. I'm useless. I'm not good enough. I can't do anything. But if you're a child, if you're a friend, if you're a colleague, somebody you really love, who oh, uh, that guy is, I'm useless. I'm a me. What mm. advice would you give them? This yeah. Thing? So, so if you were saying that to me, yeah. be oh, I'm useless. I'm rubbish. And then, I'm not going to say that. No, no, no. This is not true. But you're saying that you're useless. You're rubbish. And then, I'm not going to say that. No, no, no. This is not true. But you're positive things have you got yeah. going for you so it forces you to change your the way you look at things and those are things you should say to yourself yeah. but it's so easy you can say it to somebody yeah. else but up and honestly judge could criticize and, and it's good down, if yeah. you can say it to me mm. because then you'll start believing it yeah yeah but we must learn to say it to ourselves because we are more negative to ourselves than anybody else is to us yeah yeah definitely so that's once we start saying positive words to ourselves that will balance the root chakra mm. so the other one to identify is what do you judge criticize or dislike about others behavior yeah this dusriyan bare ki tusi nahi thonu changa lagda because jo kuch hi tusi dusriyan de nahi changa lagda is usually what that means ohi cheez tusi aapne bare nahi thonu changi nahi lagde ya tusi aap ho changi 
and you're not aware of it, Hannah. Mm. But so usually this helps. What we don't like about others, they're actually helping us to recognize what is it we don't like about ourselves. Asi hona na program kanto pella si asi aa discuss kita sega ke je koi asi kite gaye ya ta koi utthe they get all the attention. Sare ona nu gal baat kar de ya. Minu kate ni koi gal baat kar de. So we were saying like you know it's about attention. Yeah, yeah. Ke je ona nu attention sare kate mal de ya minu kate ni mal de. So this is where we look at. भी मैं अपने आप में अटेंशन दे सकती मैं कहते लोगों से डिपेंड करा भी वो मैं अटेंशन दे सो इट्स अबाउट सेल्फ लव एंड सेल्फ केयर एंड नॉट क्रिटिसाइजिंग दैट पर्सन बिकॉज़ दैट्स व्हाट यू आर मिसिंग योरसेल्फ दैट्स राइट आई थिंक दैट्स अ रियली गुड एग्जांपल इट्स अबाउट जेलसी या इट इज एंड रियली व्हाट दिस टीचिंग इज लाइक um don't depend on others anymore mm. if you want attention what's teaching us that they teaching us that if they're not giving us the attention that means we need to learn to give it to ourselves yeah, yeah. and when we start giving it to ourselves then we won't even notice it from mm. others that sanu nahi de reya yeah so this is when we again just apne unu attention pehla de jao na that will balance the root chakra yeah yeah so eda kya rakhyo agar ke attention hai na jadon tusi kisi tu jealous feel karde ya insecure feel karde o thoda ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਚ ਕੋਈ ਕੁਛ ਮਿਸ ਹੁੰਦਾ ਆ ਤਾਂ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਨਾਟ ਗਿਵਿੰਗ ਟੂ ਯੂਰਸੈਲਫ ਸੋ ਸੋ ਗਿਵ ਦੈਟ ਟੂ ਯੂਰਸੈਲਫ ਨਾਲ ਰਿਫਲੈਕਟ ਕਰੋ ਸੋਚੋ ਵੀ ਮੈਂ ਕਾਤੇ ਮੈਂ ਕਾਤੇ ਇਦਾਂ ਫੀਲ ਕਰਦੀ ਦੂਸਰੇ ਬਾਰੇ ਹੈ ਨਾ ਸੋ ਦ ਅਦਰ ਵਨ ਵੀ ਗਨ ਆਈਡੈਂਟੀਫਾਈ ਸੋ ਵੈਨ ਡੂ ਯੂ ਪੁੱਟ ਅਦਰਸ ਫਰਸਟ ਔਰ ਯੂ ਡਿਨਾਈ ਯੂਰ ਓਨ ਡਿਜ਼ਾਇਰਸ ਐਂਡ ਵਾਟ ਪ੍ਰੋਮਪਟਸ ਯੂ ਟੂ ਡੂ ਥਿਸ ਥਿਸ ਇਜ਼ ਅਨਦਰ ਕਮਿੰਗ ਫਰਮ ਅ ਪਲੇਸ ਆਫ ਪੀਪਲ ਪਲੀਜ਼ਿੰਗ ਐਂਡ ਐਂਡ ਸੈਲਫ ਅਬੈਂਡਨਿੰਗ ਯੂਰਸੈਲਫ ਸੋ ਥੈਟਸ ਅਨਦਰ ਵੇ ਆਫ ਰੈਕਗਨਾਈਜ਼ਿੰਗ ਥੈਟ we are causing unbalance in the root chakra and how we can change this and how do you change this so ede bari jada aap kehne ha ke assi lokan nu khosh kari jande ha ha na jehdi vi cheez hogi we keep them happy par par assi fir apne aap nu neglect karde ha sanu vi chahida ya ve khosh khosh assi kariye apne aap layi so then a change karnu then you have to try and put yourself first ke je koi kehnda vi itthe chaliye utthe chaliye par je thoda nahi dil karda tusi keh sakde nahi aaj mera ji nahi karda and you might do something you want to do even that if that's taking a long bath or having your hair done your nails i mean you know i don't know the men might want to go do something different i don't know gardening or that is so stereotypical i'm sorry about that <laughs> but, uh, but i'm just saying uh, that the more you just do just this examples. yeah but i'm saying the more you do this and then you start liking yourself and then thodi apni qadr tusi jyada karan lag jande yeah. and your self worth starts to build up and once you feel respect as well and and the more that you do that then you feel more um, at peace secure and the fear starts to dissipate and yeah. it starts leaving yeah. your energy field and we start feeling more connected and feeling the zest of life enjoying our uh, you know existence on this yeah. planet yeah. the more we start doing things for ourselves because when we start filling our vessel up and then we actually find out that we can have enough to to help other people help other people yeah but we are sickly who now most of the time and then we want someone else to fill us up but that actually put so much pressure and giving that responsibility to other people that actually makes other people want to actually um get distance from us but the distance whole like in this article then we have the fear of being alone then we start feeling af- afraid of being existing on this planet because everybody is a fear of death when they yeah. think of being alone and also sometimes it that hundi jado tusi apne aap nu kisi nu de hi jande de hi jande they'll just take advantage so it's important be to see thoda ke take a step back and value yourself your own self worth self love to see apne aap te thode ke je time kat ke spend karyo bhi tuhanu kehdi cheezan changiyan lagdiyan tu si ki karna ki nahi karna so um you know we're talking about um what is it that you dislike about yourself or or tell yourself that are your weaknesses thodiyan khubiyan ki hai te thodiyan kamiyan ki hai tu si apne aap recognize karo bhi thodiyan quality ki hai so make a list of 100 things ke jehdiyan tu si um soot soot ke keh sakde bhi main i'm a good cook i'm i care for my family i do this jindi abhi tu si lek sakde ho unna hi jyada thoda um self esteem badda ya apne aap bare you don't think oh i'm rubbish at this i'm rubbish at that so that's a really really good good list to make so all these that uh, explain kitta all these questions and how to identify to changing our thinking so this soot badda de na 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 
these actually help us to heal our fear you know dar dar soch ya na e sara symptoms heal kar de just changing our way of thinking and you know and our perspective about ourselves and the world and this will heal the unbalanced root chakra because the root chakra the balance of kanana we have to really start valuing ourselves sadi apne apne qadar karni hai and actually enjoying our existence on this planet and start to feel safe and 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 actually keeping dinasi keep deeply rooted to mother earth or nice said a root chakra balance rehna because once the root chakra balance rehna fir baki the root chakras ana or up and all the now start staying balanced so we need to start with the root chakra we'll, because we are in a spiritual beings having this human experience but to have the human experience we really need to feel safe first and and actually allow ourselves to connect with mother earth because dharti ma has everything all the resources we need to live a very or not just physical body which is very important but even mentally we'll start to feel like you know life this this you know experience we're having here can be a very heavenly one so so the whole point of this program you know to do with the root chakra you know if you think of it in a different way as well get disconnect from uh digital media you know the tv the radio the um your phones and things like that because that's where the problem definitely occurs um and and that's what creates that disconnection with the earth nature everything else like that and that's where all the mental health issues definitely arise mm. from um yeah. you know being around that all the time so put your phone down spend time with your family your friends go out you know where you don't look at your you know whatever social media you're on or anything like that because that's what's going to help you feel more connected whether you do it you know as a family or with your friends or even on your own spend time with yourself appreciate who you are and the value that you give to your family your friends mm-hmm. rather than um devaluing yourself because this is where you know you will find the imbalance mm-hmm. in your chakra so um you know we hope you've uh, had you've got a much deeper understanding of of everything that we've talked about in terms of the root chakra um the rest of the programs are going to be about the other six chakras yeah so the um, next week we'll be de- talking about the the sacral and the sacral is the orange color one and that's more to do with our relationship with ourselves and other people and about pleasure and creativity but like i said that chakra you know if we're not feeling safe and the root chakra is not balanced or that you know side effect bad <laughs> effect will have on the sacral chakra so if we don't feel safe in our existence on the planet and then we won't have a, a very good healthy relationships with people so you can't imagine yourself in enjoying the pleasures of life if you don't feel safe on this planet and if you think about your chakras like well they're like plates which kind of balance on top of each other so if the bottom plate isn't strong and solid and firm then everything else is going to be out of whack over, yeah. it's going to topple over or whichever way you look at it so so that's how we are so if you think of ourselves as even like a tree mm-hmm. you've got to be solid your roots have got to be well into the earth and you know you've got to stand tall and you've got to be positive towards yourself in order for everything else to work out for you to to become a more spiritual person and and not feel unbalanced with your relationships with your friends and everything else like that <laughs> hope you've enjoyed the show but thank you so much and we'll see you next week take care thank you bye bye